His name's Jar, and his name's Rake. What kind of names are those? Greetings. Have you come here to oh see? Oh my God. Enlightened? Maybe. You work for him. Errands, guard duty. Um, the enlightened travels a lot. Yeah, he needs someone to care for his property when he is away. That sounds like a good job. Indeed. Rake and I did many things before the Enlightened found us and took us away from Kudnar. Have you heard about the orcs? Aye. Who has not by now? Castle Hedeborg has surely fallen by now. They say it cannot fall, but I was there before the siege started, and they did not have enough provisions for a long sea. Why did you come north? We had a difference of opinion with a jury. They wanted to hang us, and Enlighten saved us. We thought he must be mad to take two murderers as private guards, but, well, we knew nothing of his talents then. Hey, what the fuck's up with this guy? What of his talents now then? Do not show disrespect for the Enlighten, and never underestimate him. Many have learned that to their cost. Useful information. However, I think I must leave now. Do you have such need for haste? Indeed. What can you tell me about the neighborhood? Gorlin is up there. Mostly thieves and Giritza men. But honest smugglers can be found too, if you look hard enough. But avoid Gorlin unless you seek real problems. Who will never enter the Dwarven ruins. They are haunted. Haunted ruins? Where are they? They are not far from here. Some people from Gorilin searched for dwarven machinery there, and they simply vanished. Or so I heard, anyway. Be warned. Good day to you. We never had a red one. Necromancy is the path oh. of the damned. You enter upon that path at your own risk. What can you teach? The principles of magic, alchemy, and body control are the most. What is your price? Each lesson will cost you 1,000 in gold. 1,000 gold to learn necromancy. Okay. Noted. It was peak. Peak. Hey, buddy. Mr. Robber. Hail, Master Traveler. Well met. You are far from the village. <laughs> it's because I followed a thief to this cave. But I will not enter. Why not? But I will not enter. The cave is full of vicious skeletons. Skeletons? Skeletons, eh? That is not so dangerous, methinks. Oh. May have yeah, never saw simple. an oblivion too. If you can <laughs> handle skeletons, a simple solid would be easy for you, methinks. Listen, I cannot pay you, but, but but I could put in a good word for you with the Brotherhood. My brother is a member. And I can give you this mace to help you fight the skeletons. Tis old, but could help against these monsters. Oh, you're gonna give me a mace? Oh, you can keep it. I um he works in the He kitchen. works in the kitchen. Cool. Not just any kitchen. He prepares food for the drag. Is he a cook? The best. Tis a family heirloom. Passed on to the oldest. Hold. Who's there? Only a sad traveler in search of good spirits. Haven't you heard that it's dangerous to travel alone? I can take care of myself. Can ya? <laughs> can ya? Oh, you are the one who is in danger here. I advise you pack up and move elsewhere. Or, oh, yes, I can take care of myself and of you, too. Oh, he's got a lot of HP. Oh, what a dodge. Oh, he hurts.
Oh, I got to play the long game here. I always picture when duels like this happen, like the cinematic, like it looks really lame here, but like I'm picturing this as like a duel between two like actual fighters. Like it's like full on full grit fighting tooth and nail. Summoning the most of their skill that they possibly can in order to slay their assailant. Oh, the crit! The critical hit! Oh, the second critical hit! Oh, the third critical hit! You fool. Oh, he's quite nimble on his feet. Can't even get hit in. More crits. Give me the crits. That's right, suck it, nerd. Spooky skeleton scape. Huzzah! Grand skeleton. I guess the blunt weapons. What's up, losers? Oh, what a bad time to fucking for that to happen. Holy shit! Holy shit! Divide and conquer, hopefully. Are you guys seeing this? There's 20 of them! Back down! We will not yield! Do not back down! We will push forward! I've been disarmed? What are you talking about? What? Actions all at once. That's for you. Never back down, never surrender. Do they for sure they're kicking up dirt in my face and stuff? That is of no import. With pure grit. Hand over the ring. Ah, it is worthless anyway. Looked valuable at first glance. But since you know all about skeletons, uh, you could help me, methinks. Help you? And why? 
Because I will pay you well. These skeletons have turned bad on me. This used to be a good hideout, but I wanted it even safer, so... Well, I hired a necromancer to summon a few bone shakers to scare people off. That makes no sense. Aye, it does. They were meant to protect me and attack everyone else, but the necromancer somehow made a mistake. I'm no match for them. But if you think you can deal with them, I shall reward you generously. <laughs> you jest. I am a... Did you not see it? Nay, it sparkled. And he didn't exactly give it to me for an appraisal, did he now? May fortune... Yeah, Mace is OP against skeletons. Once you start, once you get an attack chain on them, they can't do anything. Well, I should be a good bit stronger. Oh, they're all grand skeletons. Ooh, that guy's got the reach. That guy's pissed me off. <laughs> gotta play a little rat, gotta play a little rat like whenever you uh, come across. A foe stronger than yourselves. For all I know, I'm not even like supposed to be here yet. Now the final. Now there's only one of them that I can continuously. I can stun lock them with the mace. Here, you have truly earned this. But, you know, these skeletons could just reappear again. I I need someone to tell that bungling necromancer to come here and fix it. Would, would you do that for me too? Where is he? I will mark his home on your map. <laughs> he will cooperate when he sees you. 270 gold pieces? My sir, my friend. Dog is not the best. Did you find the thief and my ring? What? Farewell. Is the road safe now? Splendid. You seem in good. I sold my whole stock to Rilis Welgar. He lives here in Covengore. I. 300 gold pieces, 100 experience, and I reputation with the Merchant's Guild? Hot damn! Guys, this was a very fruitful adventure. Hello, Rillis. A generous offer, but nay. Oh, 
Mike? Nay, friend, but since you wish to share... Do you know how hard it is to get any good booze these days? Aye, I do. And that is why I am here. Ha! Your hands are even shaking just looking at it! Fine! How much? Fifty gold pieces! One hex. You're new. Should I know him? Hmm. You look like one of his men. I feel like I want to join the Brotherhood. Skeldon hired a group some time ago. Strong, they say. But for me, a waste of time. And you are? I serve the House of Skeldon. The strongest and proudest of all the noble houses of Catalan. We rule in Talmont. Why are you here in this place, then? Hunting. One of the woodcutters was a Karga leader. But he was warned and fled before we arrived. The rebels know all of our moves before we even move. They are as the wind. Who is this leader you seek? Con Cronach, from the clan Karga. One of the villagers from Covangor told us his whereabouts for 20 gold pieces. I was told that the rebels have many loyal men in the villages. Peasants have no backbone. Rebels when they have to pay taxes. But you can always buy them for gold. It would seem that not every villager can be bought, or Karga would have been in your hands already. Aye, true. And that snake will be more cautious now. The only chance we have to catch him is to play his game better than he. You need someone the rebels would not suspect. Aye. You may have. Tis... More's the pity. I... Has like a low-key mysticism to it? I'm not really sure how to describe it. Goods. Do you have them? It doesn't feel like the dialogue's bad, the gameplay is clanky or whatever, but somehow the world still feels like deep and enriched. Just got back from running errands and you just finished Virtus just right now, like this second, like right after you messaged me, you got the drop. And you have the Soul Reaper Axe. Max. What the fuck? Oh, well done. My men's mumbles and Max. will end today. What the hell? And their efficiency too. That methods. you you dog. Listen, I shall buy what you have. You dog. Without your opinions. Godspeed. Hello, did you Good. Take this teleport stone and put the magnesite inside. Give the second one to me. I need it as well. How does it work? It's simple. When you the music teleport, is pretty on put point. Put the teleport stone on the ground. Step closer and activate it like a teleport. You can jump to any other active teleport this way. Does the stone teleport with me? No. The stone stays in this spot and acts as an anchor. This way, you can easily teleport back to it from any other teleport. Can I use it more than once? Yes, of course. Simply pick it up and take it along with you. What about others? Will they be able to teleport to my teleport stone? Unfortunately, yes. However, no one else can take your teleport. This means you need not fear thieves. This, this seems like it'd be really useful for like an online thing. To have more than one. As you wish. Bring me more magnesite. As always, for two crystals, you will receive one teleport stone. I shall return. Farewell. So I literally have, uh... It's League's last recall. Is what it is.